Cooler weather is here. You could turn up the heat, you could wear boots, you could wear mittens, you could wear a hat, or you could just drink to stay warm. That's more fun. I agree. I stopped by the Spire Bar at Arizona Biltmore and spoke to bartender Tice Volabrecht to learn three cocktails to help warm up this winter. Starting with Golden Orchard Cider. Cider is one of those things that you associate with cold weather. Exactly. For this cozy cocktail, you'll need warm apple cider, a quarter ounce of Drambuy, a quarter ounce of Frangelico, and one and a half ounce of Hennessy. The Frangelico sticks out because of the hints of hazelnut, and it's a cordial, so it's sugar and sweet, and Hennessy completes it. And Hennessy completes me. Always. Give it a stir, pour into a sugar rim glass, and enjoy. Oh wow, that feels like knit mittens going down. <laughs> it really does. I love that. Next, a beverage known as tip of the iceberg that starts with an infused ice cube. This one has espresso, Kahlua, uh -huh. and it has demerara syrup, it organic sugar. Got it really, really cold for a long period of time, okay. and that's gonna start our cocktail. But you can make that at home just in your ice cube tray. And that's the point. And the only other ingredient, rum chata. I have never understood rum chata in my life. What is it? So it's just rum mixed in with a little bit of dairy cream. Enjoy. Do I wait for this to melt, or this is a journey? It's a journey. Oh my gosh, that's delicious. My insides are sitting by the fire right now, toasty warm. It hits home. Our final cocktail, the Biltmore G&T. Gin and tonic is a classic. So ours is elevated. The cube actually already has the tonic water in there. Add three ounces of gin. And gin will warm you up from the inside, won't it? Absolutely. Yeah, it's very uh, earthy, very uh, piney for the season. And a half ounce of elderflower before garnishing with lavender quill, lime wheels, and glucose garnish. That's gorgeous. It's definitely for aesthetics. It's almost like a lollipop. Thank you. No oh, wow. World's best gin and tonic. And by the end, it's gonna be a little bit different than your first try. Cause the tonic melts. I love it. We're staying toasty with winter cocktails. <laughs>